In this video, I'm going to show you how you can earn money online by copying and pasting images. And best of all, this method is free. I'm currently using this method and platforms that I'm going to show you here today to earn passive income. So if you are interested in finding out how you can do this method, do stick around until the end of this video. Without wasting any more time, let's get right into it. All right, guys. So in this video, I'm going to show you where to find images, what to do with the images and where to paste the images in order to start earning income. I'm also going to show you guys my proof of payment from this very platform that I'm going to be sharing with you here today. So let's get started. The website that you can find images for absolutely free is a website called raw pixels. You will see that they have free images here as well as premium images. But what we are most interested in for this video is public domain images. Public domain images are images that are released to the public for them to use as they like. As you can see here, we are making this available to you to use as you like with a CCO license. So this license allows you to use these images also commercially. In other words, you can use them for profit gains as well. There are quite a lot of different images that you can use to sell here. So you can scroll through to find images that you can use for this method. And in case you want to use images that you have or an idea of, you can simply search here to find flowers. For an example, by searching here, it's going to show you all the different flowers that are in the public domain so that you can use for today's video so in order to get started we're going to download one of these images and i like this flower and butterfly uh, image here in order to download you simply click on the image and you're going to download by clicking free download here just confirm that it is a free uh, image that is on the public domain click here to find the highest size possible and click free download so this is going to save your image on your computer or device that you are using in case you want to find other websites you can use a platform called pexels it allows you to use images here commercially provided you alter them first that that is changing the color around uh, bringing in other elements around before you can use them commercially and pixabay also has a similar license where you can use images for free even for commercial use but you just want to make sure that you click their license here to see what is allowed and what is not allowed now once you're done you need to move on to the next step and that is going to canva canva is a free platform where you can create different designs and within canva you can find different images as well that you can copy and paste to our next platform we're going to be uploading the image that we downloaded from raw pixel but before we do that we're going to create a design a custom design so click on the right hand corner create a design and we're going to create the biggest size possible by clicking custom size and creating it as a 5,000 by 5,000 pixel size and click create new design now navigate to where you've saved your image on your desktop or phone and upload it to canva just by dragging it like that and uploading it adjust it to fill the box if you can possibly do that but the idea here is to make your image as big as possible just making sure that it doesn't lose the quality that it has if you want to remove the background color you can go ahead and do so by clicking edit image on canva provided you have the pro version of canva and if you click the link in my description box you can get canva pro for absolutely free for 30 days a trial for 30 days click remove background to remove the background color of the image and this is going to allow you more flexibility on the next platform in the next step you need to download this image out of canva so that you can upload it to the platform where you're going to sell it so to do that simply click on the right hand corner share click download the download button here download it as png because this is an image format that is going to allow you to download with a transparent background because we've already removed the background so click png also increase the size of your pixels so that you can get the best quality possible out of your image so i'm going to make this into 7.5 you can make it up to 10 for the next platform so i think up to 10,000 
by 10,000 pixels is fine. Remember to click transparent background so that it can be exported without a background here. Select download. The platform that we're going to use to sell these images is called Redbubble. Definitely not new here on the channel, but Redbubble is a print on demand platform where you can customize different kinds of items and sell them. The good thing about Redbubble is that it's absolutely free for anyone to start and it's available worldwide. How it works is is you'll go to Redbubble and create a store, which we're going to do together, come up with different designs, more especially original designs because that's what they appreciate more of or what the platform was created more for upload the designs to your redbubble store and start selling so to get started with redbubble go to their platform using the link in my description you will land on a home page that looks like this you can see the different kinds of items that you can customize with your design with just one design you can customize all of these different items and as you scroll down you'll see examples of original customized items on the Redbubble platform. So what you want to do here is to start the sign up process by clicking sell your art. You will land on a page like this one. This is where you can click start selling to start signing up. The sign up process is really, really easy. You need to make sure that you've highlighted the artist sign up tab here and you fill in your email address. You create a username, create a password and click this button here, start the sign up process. Remember to go to the email that you've used to sign up to confirm your red bubble account with them now that your store has been created log into your store to start selling so i'm already logged into my red bubble store and this is the page that i landed on you will see that there are different kinds of designs from different designers that are on this platform and they are placed on different items as well so if you want to find inspiration you can go ahead and check out the different designs on different items here on red bubble but to get started uploading your created design or your images your copied image simply click your account icon here and click add new work upload it on this tab here by clicking upload new image navigate to where you've saved your image on your computer and this is the image here without the background the png that i have saved so i want to bring your attention to the right here this is where you're going to fill out very important details it's important on redbubble that you fill out the title of your design you can use up to 15 tags but it's important that you fill them out all because tags are a way that people are going to discover your designs and items so a bit more research on what works in terms of tags for the design that you've uploaded is very very important also fill in the description of your item because that's what your customers are going to see so i'm going to go ahead and fill out all the information and come back here to be with you but online you can find different hashtags that are used for images similar to yours so just make sure that you get 15 that are most recommended and the website that i use mostly is this one called besthashtags.com and how you enter hashtags on redbubble is you enter a hashtag for example flower and separate them by a comma here space and then flower and shells uh, for this example all right guys so i've put in my title my tags i'm gonna add more later and i've also put in my description right here which is the same as my title by the way so i'm just gonna go ahead and scroll down to show you guys that now this design is sitting on different items as you can see as i scroll down the same design is on different items here so you'll notice that there are some items that are new and are disabled so if you want to sell this design on these items as well simply click disabled here to enable them but this is how the design looks like placed on different items so i'm just gonna go ahead and enable this design um, on different items so that they can be available in my store now another thing that you need to do or if you want to you can edit your item so in case i want to put this or centralize it properly you can simply click the edit button on any item 
here and adjust your design by maybe dragging it to the left dragging it to the right to make it more central make it smaller if you want to um and so on just make sure that it's it's seated at a position that you want it to and if you want to add a background color for an example on your item you can go ahead and select a color here uh, that can work with your design but this is just an example of how you can better design so you'll see that i've added a blue color on my kitten although i do like it as wide you do have that option to edit your design you can also create your design as a pattern to show you an example if i wanted this very design to be a pattern on this a-line dress i would click edit and then scroll down here and choose a pattern you can use a regular grid pattern or offset pattern by selecting it and then adjust here to just uh see how you want your pattern to sit on your dress once you're done apply changes and look at the pattern this is how it's going to look like on your item so the next step is look at which item looks good with this design so we do have the head here i'm going to just adjust a bit and make sure that this design is sitting centrally inside here and also it is centered uh, properly and yeah guys you can choose the item colors as well as you explore so this is how it's looking like scroll down to this part here right at the bottom you will see media here you're allowed to select two different kinds of media and that is a painting or mixed media art as well as digital art so you can only select two you'll see the collections here these are collections that i created within my store so you can only do this once you've signed up you've set up your store you can now break down your designs and put them into different collections so i've created nature collections life love love essential inspirational ocean and so on so i'm going to put this in beautiful patterns as well as in nature collections so it's going to appear in two collections you also need to select the default product that will appear in your store so this is what people are going to see first before they see that your design is actually placed on different items so for this design i'm going to select a sticker as a default product for my store stickers tend to sell more in this platform so if you get a design that's going to look good on a sticker i advise that maybe you go with a sticker you also need to select whether the content that you've uploaded or your design is a mature content or for mature people or not so if there's no nudity there is no bad language and so on you simply select no and move on to the next step select yes if you have permission to sell the design that you want to sell on this platform and save your work so yes guys so far i've shown you how to copy images to paste on the red bubble platform as well as how to place the images on the red bubble platforms my image is currently processing it's going to take about 15 minutes for your product or your item to appear and show on your red bubble store so you will see now the different mockups that we have here the first item is the sticker which is what this uh, uh design is optimized for you will see the different masks you'll see the blankets um the pet mats and so on and yeah guys as you can see here now the t-shirts are worn by real people or real looking models here so it's going to show you how the item is going to look or the design is going to look on a t-shirt so once it's loaded you'll be able to see how it's going to look in your store because to advertise on your store they're going to use real human being uh, mock-ups that you are seeing here guys i did mention to you guys that redbubble has paid me before and i still receive passive income here and there by doing the same exact thing that i have done here today the important thing with redbubble is to make sure that you don't upload one design and wait for a sale the more items or design your store has the more chances for you to get to sell here so i'm just going to go to my email to show you some of the payment notifications that i've received for payments from red bubble so here we go red bubble 
you've made a sale. So you will see guys that even in this August, I did receive some payments here. These are for designs that I've uploaded to my store about two years ago. So this is the platform where you can literally copy images online and upload them to make a sale. I think you can help your store by maybe creating social media platforms for your store, maybe on Instagram and uploading every design or showing uh, your followers every design that you have uploaded to your Redbubble store. Also on Pinterest because Pinterest is all about images. You can create an account there linked to your uh, print Redbubble print on demand store. Do let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching and if if you are using Redbubble to make money, you are making money, do share some of your strategies. Now, remember we spoke about copying images and selling images. You don't have to use images to sell on this platform. This is another successful store that is only selling items with words only. So you'll see that they create simple catchphrases, simple words here and upload them to Redbubble and sell their stuff. And of course, they are one of the best sellers on the platform. So you can come up with any creative stuff. It could be words, it could be images to sell on this platform to earn passive income. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Until then, have a great time.